asks, if I wanted the smoothest nib available in an extra fine, or at most a fine, what should I be looking at? But if I wanted to see what really smooth felt like in my preferred line width, what should be on my wish list? I already have such pens as a Lamy Safari Extra Fine, a Twisby 580 All Extra Fine, and a Pilot Metropolitan Extra Fine. Uh, Japanese nibs are generally finer. Yes, that is the case. Um, but Pilot, uh, I find, makes really good fine nibs. I really like the fine that they have on their Custom 74, the Custom 823, uh, the, the Metropolitan, like you have here. Uh, the Vanishing Point is a really decent uh, fine nib. The Extra Fine tends to be a little bit on the feedbacky side for my taste, but still, it's, it's a very, very fine Extra Fine. Um, but, uh, you know, so that one I might kind of more push you towards the fine nib, honestly. Um, they have other pens like the E95S, the Stargazer, the Justice 95. All of those fine nibs are going to be pretty darn smooth. So actually, Pilot's got a pretty good range. Platinum makes good fine and extra fine nibs that are very fine, um, but their, their nibs tend to have a little more feedback to them. So I'm hesitant to kind of recommend those just because you are looking for the smoothest available. Um, some other ones, let's see here, um, the Platinum Preppy Extra Fine is actually pretty pretty darn good, even for a $5 pen, uh, is pretty smooth for how fine that nib is. Um, and actually Faber-Castell, uh, their Extra Fine nib is really, really good, really extra fine. Uh, very stiff, so not quite as soft as some of the Pilot ones, uh, but really not too bad at all. So that should give you a good jumping point.